killed these people. Samahani mtazamaji kwa hilo. Waziri wa Usalama wa Ndani Daktari Fred Matiang'e amedokeza kuwa wanaandaa sheria ambazo zitaangazia ndoa baina ya maafisa wa polisi. Huku akisema endapo afisa wa polisi atamuoa afisa mwenzake ni lazima mmoja wa maafisa hawa juzulu kutoka kwenye kikosi hicho. Matiang'e alizungumza katika chuo cha mafunzo ya polisi cha Kiganjo ambapo amefungua rasmi mafunzo ya makurutu 300 kwa kuelezea kuwa sheria hiyo itahakikisha kuna nidhamu kwenye kikosi cha polisi kama inavyo tumika kwenye vikosi vingine mfano vya kijeshi mwanahabari wetu Daniel Kariuki anaarifu kwa kina Waziri wa Usalama wa Ndani Daktari Fred Matiangi alifika kwenye chuo cha mafunzo ya polisi cha Kiganjo kufungua rasmi mafunzo ya wanakadeti katika mfumo mpya uliozinduliwa na Rais Uhuru Kenyatta katika idara ya polisi Akiwa hapa alichukua nafasi kuzungumzia yaliyokuwa yakijitokeza katika idara hiyo kuhusiana na ndoa kati ya maafisa wa polisi. So one thing that is going to change is gender relations and how we manage male female relations in the security sector in the country. We will adopt the system that has been adopted by the KDF for example. You are officers. We do not expect you to live here and go to have affairs with your constables whom you are managing. When it gets to that point one of you has to leave because we must maintain a certain standard of conduct in the police service. Kulingana na Matiangi, tayari mapendekezo haya yanasubiri kupitishwa na baraza la usalama nchini huku akionya wakuu kwenye idara ya polisi dhidi ya kuahadaki mapenzi kina dada kwenye idara. We are even insisting to the Inspector General that cases of sexual harassment in the service will be orderly room proceedings type of cases and the officers who are involved should be stripped of their ranks and gotten out of the service. Wizara ya Usalama wa Ndani imedokeza kutamaushwa kutokana na vifo vya maafisa wa polisi. Kumekuwa na ongezeko la visa kadha wa kadha vya polisi walioana kumuua mwenzake na kisha kujitoa uhai na sasa wizara inasema inapania kutatua hili. Hata hivyo wale ambao tayari wameoana kwenye idara hawataathirika na haya mapya. Tighten your belt we are now beginning a phase of very very stringent changes in the service and in the manner in which we go forward we will not have a police service where some of our members feel mistreated some of our members feel uh, treated uh, as less of human beings wakati huo huo matiangi amewaomba makurutu hao kujitolea kuhudumu taifa watakapofuzu na kujenga ushirikiano mzuri baina yao na wananchi huku inspector mkuu wa polisi Hilary Mtiambai kielezea kuwa usajili wa makurutu hao utasaidia kikosi cha polisi we are stepping up our management of the police service and as we change our target now is to look at the ecosystem within which we do the policing. That's why I like what I hear from the Inspector General that we are going to give you responsibilities immediately you live here to start managing those this stage as they leave this college there will be enough experience to run a station beginning as deputy deputy OCS. Makrutu hao watakuwa wa kwanza kupokea mafunzo ya kadeti watakapohitimu watakabidhiwa wathwa wa inspekta wa polisi na kusimamia stesheni mbalimbali humu nchini Daniel Karioki KTN News Shirika la kutetea haki la Haki Afrika limesikitikia mauaji